because they did kill you off, didn't they? So yes. were you, were you oh. happy about that or disappointed that you can't go back? Because a lot of people, you know, the doors open, the jar. Do you get a choice yeah. even? No, you, well, no, you don't get a choice. I mean, I kind of said, look, I want to go. It was about a year before I left. Um, and it's obviously up to you guys whether I die or not. Um, and a few months later, the producer said, right, we are going to kill you off. And I was like, okay, well, oh, that's quite yeah, nerve wracking, yeah. but okay, let's go for it. And do you know what? It's the best thing ever because otherwise I'll be looking over my shoulder all the time thinking, yes. what if? And now mm -hmm. I don't have that. I've, yeah, I've, I've got, got that to move forward. Right? Yeah. You have, you, were there you, any, sorry, were there any other chances earlier on in the career with Emma Dole <clears> that you thought, I need to go or opportunities I mean, that you turn down from time to time you know but it's been perfect for me because I've got my daughter Mia who's 10 now and over that time I've kind of been at home so I've been bringing her up and working at the same time so it's been the perfect job Wonderful, for me right, yeah right yeah yes it's been ideal but now it feels it's, timings right yeah definitely but you yeah. could go back even though you say, I could. You, yeah. you say, you you know, we said at the beginning, oh, well, you can't go because you clearly killed yourself. But uh, yeah. there's quite a history of people who appear to be dead. Yes. I mean, back yes. in yes. Yes. If you could come Pretty. back, yeah, who would you come shower. back as? <laughs> who would I come back as? Oh, my gosh. Um, probably like a really messed up version of myself. Of, not, of, not of me. <laughs> 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 of myself. Of Katie, of the character. That would be quite good. Yeah. Because um, she was, she could be quite sweet most of the time. Maybe something a bit more. Mm. Yeah. With yeah. 13 <laughs> years is a long time, isn't, isn't it? it? I know. It's, it is. It's a long time. It is a long time. But do you know what is? I don't have anything bad to say about the job. It really was the best 13 years of my life. I loved it, and that's why it was difficult to make that decision to go. I was working with my best friends every day. Yeah. Um, I was near home, and. You know, it was brilliant. I got yeah. a great storyline. So it and it's great training, it's... isn't it? For sorry, it's, yeah. it's great training because it's a relentless schedule. Yeah. And now yeah. you're on a, a big drama, which I presume yeah. is a little bit. I mean, different, but a little bit easier on the schedule. You're not. It is. It's of... easier on the schedule. You get more time. Yeah. You get more time to talk things through and rehearse. Um, you know, and chat with the director, like in an hour's session, yeah. just with the director, me and him, which on Emmerdale, you just, you just don't oh, get that time. Don't give us a little a rough idea. I know you can't give the story yeah, away it, too much. But... Um, so I play Lucy. It used to be Emma in the original script, that's why. That's, um, I knew yeah, that. Yeah, don't I knew that. that. <laughs> <laughs> so my research, me and Ruth read oh. the script together. And it yeah. Um, yeah, so it's, I play Lucy Murdoch, who is Philip's daughter, um, heavily pregnant, um, having lots of trouble with her mm. boyfriend and um, she finds herself in danger and um, yeah it's about those two kind of trying to find each other again and get back on track because they've been through quite a hard time together so. and it's a hostage situation it is so quite a scary one I guess. yeah there. it's what I'm kind of used to doing actually it's my <laughs> thing um, yeah it's lots of crying and screaming and oh, being thrown and not around screaming, and not screaming it's not you is it no no honestly I, did I, scream, I actually I'm said to at home and go that's not her she's got <laughs> <No>. <laughs> <laughs> he made me do it over and over oh, really? he said the first one I did he said it sounded like a yelp <laughs> so I was like okay I'll try again mm -hmm. um, but yeah it was good it was really good fun yeah and that yeah. starts uh, next Wednesday the night of December. Now, did you get Christmas off? Are you at home? Have you done your tree yet? Anything happening? Um, no, I've not. I've not done my tree yet. I'm kind of, I want to get this week out of the way and then I'm going to do Christmas tree this weekend. Yeah. But you switched some Christmas sorted. lights on, haven't you? Yes. Yeah. yeah, I've done some Christmas lights in Bolton, um, which was great actually, because it's kind of, I used to go there when I was younger and yeah. watch the, you know, the lights switch on. And uh... Now, they did say when the lights went on, <laughs> those are so great. Oh, 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 text message from my sister actually going oh, I'm sorry oh Sammy God. did you actually see this and I was like no Oh, thank God I didn't. On the it's candles and berries, obviously. Oh, obviously. <laughs> obviously. Just, what I did people know. do when I those lights that. went on? Well, I didn't see it at the time. It was my Maybe sister that said she'd seen it in the press after about something. And I was like, oh, my God. Right. OK. Oh, well, happy Christmas, Christmas to them. Christmas Lovely. Thank you. Yeah. thank you very much. <laughs> Sammy Winwood, everybody. Thank you.